Well, good morning everybody and welcome to the channel. Hey, today let's talk about something exciting and that is tires. Specifically, what I prefer on the Toyota Tacoma. Which tire, and I'm going to talk about two, that I really like. Now, you may know if you watch the channel, I had uh, Goodyear, or not Goodyear, Nitto Ridge Grapplers on the Tacoma before I went back to stock to trade it off. So I have a good deal of experience with the Nitto Ridge Grapplers, and I have the Goodyear Wrangler Duratrax on the Tundra right now. So I'm kind of comparing those two. First of all, what are they? Well, I'm going to look at one tire size, and that is what I have on the Tundra back there. Not much different than the Nitto Ridge Grapplers I had. And those are a 275-55R20, and it's a designation 113T for what that's worth. Now, they are classified, and both of these are, as an on-off-road commercial traction tire. Price-wise, the Wranglers back there, the Goodyears, $235.00. And 99 cents. That's up as of today, rather, on Tire Rack's website. The load rating per tire on the Goodyears is 2,535 pounds. They're rated at a speed of T, which is up to 118 miles per hour. So if you really want to get out there and go, you can do it. Rated by owners. Now, this is, I think, much more important than any expert rating, right? This is a rating that is an average of all of the feedback uh, that was submitted by owners, people that actually live with these tires, drive on them every day. The Wranglers are rated at a 4.5. That's 4.5 out of 5. Not too bad. Maximum tire inflation, inflation rather, is 51 pounds and tire weight 46 pounds. A little bit lighter than the Nitto Ridge Grapplers. Now, I want to run through some of the uh, ratings, some of the areas that people rated these tires on to give you guys an idea. Off-road performance, and we're still talking about the good years, is rated at a 9. That's 9 out of 10. That's an excellent rating. Wet performance is an 8.6. Again, ranked as excellent. Dry performance is an 8.5. We dropped a little bit to good on that one. Uh, winter snow performance, 8.8. .8, back up to excellent. Comfort performance, 8.0, they are an on-off-road kind of hybrid tire, if you will. And tread wear performance is an 8.4, which is good as well. Uh, warranty, six years or 50,000 miles. Now, let's talk about the Nitto Ridge Grapplers. Not as much information out there about them, strangely. I don't know why. Price-wise, $233, so $2.99 per tire less. I'd call them just about equal. Weight, 48 pounds, so 2 pounds per tire heavier, or they add 8 pounds total for the vehicle more than the Goodyear's would. Maximum inflation is 50 pounds, or 50 PSI, and speed rating is again up to 118 miles per hour. The customer rating from all of the feedback out there on the Nitto Ridge Grapplers is a 4.3, a little bit lower than the Goodyear's. And the warranty, and this is kind of strange, warranty for Nittos is five years with no mileage specification. Now you might think that's a good thing, but from the reading that I did, it seems like they want to pull them in, take a look at, look at them, and they'll determine how you've treated those tires before they approve or disapprove that warranty. So maybe not so good. So what do I think? What do I prefer? You know, as I mentioned, I've had both the Nittle Ridge Grappler and the Goodyear Wrangler Duratrax. And I gotta say, I prefer the Goodyear Duratrax. Why? I think because they're just a smoother, quieter tire. And they feel better on the road. They're more comfortable, you know? They feel softer. And that might be because possibly they're made from a softer compound, maybe the belting in them is a little bit firmer, you know, the Nitto Ridge Grappler, I don't know. But they just feel better to me and they sound better. I don't hear them slapping the pavement as much as I do with the Nitto Ridge Grapplers. Uh, wear. 
My experience with them, um, both seem to be about the same. I don't notice any big difference in wear between the Ridge Grapplers or the Goodyear Duratrax. So from that standpoint, I'd say they're pretty equal. So if I had to choose, and what I'll probably do down the road when I switch out tires or have to replace them on the next Tacoma, is go with the Goodyear Wrangler Duratrax. Track, I just think they're a better tire all around. I think they're equally as off-road capable as the Nitto Ridge Grapplers, but they're better as far as daily livability, road noise, comfort, and all that good stuff. Anyway, I just wanted to get on here, kind of talk about that a little bit. I get a lot of questions about it. There you go. You've got my opinion. Leave a comment down below. If you've got experience with either one of these tires, I'd be curious to hear what you guys think. Uh, which one do you like the best? Or how are the ones that you have performing? As usual, appreciate you guys watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And we'll see you next time on the web. Have a great day. Bye.